Hey, what's going on? Shane with the 5 to 9 Creator. Today, we're going to take a special first look at Opus Pro. Opus Pro is a AI video editing software. It's more of a repurposing software that's web-based. But when I tell you that this is going to revolutionize the way that you make short clips, I am not kidding. Let's dive right into it. So the first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is go to Google, type in Opus Pro, and it's gonna be the very first link and you're gonna get a web page just like this. In so many words, what Opus Pro does is it takes a long form video and it chops it up into small, high quality, short form clips for you. The AI does everything. All you have to do is put the link to the YouTube video that you wanna make clips out of and Opus Pro does the rest. It scans your video or hooks and then creates a clip around that hook that's related to the subject of that hook. And then it ranks it on a scale of virality. They can basically tell you whether or not this video has the chance to go viral based on AI algorithms. It can also detect who's talking in a video. So if you're doing an interview, the person speaking will always be on screen. So you don't have to worry about cutting back and forth. It also highlights your clips and makes high quality engaging captions for you all automatically. All right, so let's actually do a walkthrough of how it edits clips. So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do is sign in with your Google account, find a YouTube video that's over 15 minutes and paste the link in this box here. Once you paste the clip in the box, it's gonna tell you what the video resolution is gonna be, as well as how long the video you pasted is. And you just click the purple button. Within seconds, it's gonna tell you the title of the clip that you selected, about how long it's gonna to take to generate short form clips, and that it's gonna email you once those clips are done. All right, so when your clips are ready, you're gonna get an email, you click that email, you open up the web browser, and you get these beautiful clips. This video was originally an hour and 21 minutes, and I got a total of, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 short form clips that are pretty much all around 30 seconds. So I just got 15 pieces of content from an hour and 20 minutes worth of a podcast that I took off of YouTube for this example. Now, if you post one video a day, that's 15 days, that's half a month's worth of content in eight minutes from an hour and 20 minute podcast. That's incredible. Let's watch one of these videos and I'll show you what I mean by how awesome this software is. In the last year, I've heard about um, more sex parties from from people I've met that there's things you hear about, you think about like in movies. What is that down here? So uh, one in LA, I heard about um, a friend told me that they're, they were a neighbor had, one of their neighbors rents their house out and they like, they look over one day and they're like, there's people in tuxedos, just like eyes wide shut. And they're all holding drinks, watching people have sex. So it was more like the performance. They're just watching people bang. And I was like, holy shit, that like, it's one of those things like that's really happening. That's really cool. And that's, that's the clip. It only took eight minutes to make 15 of those. Notice this is a, a a low res preview so don't worry it gets a it's a better quality video it has this virality score ranking it tells you why it gave you that score it gives you the transcript down here you can automatically post it to YouTube shorts Instagram reels and TikTok are coming later you can download the clip and then you can make small adjustments like if there's a misspelling you can correct the spelling of a word you can change the highlight color if you want or change which letters and you can change which words are highlighted you can have preferences for turning off captions, changing the color of the highlights, changing how the screen is filled with your video. So you can split between two different speakers. You can fit a horizontal video in a vertical format, or you can fill a horizontal video or a vertical video in a vertical format. You can make it all uppercase text. You can add emojis. I mean, it's pretty good as it is. Still think they can use some improvements, which we'll talk about a little bit later, but for what it is, it's amazing. All right, so that's a walkthrough. Now I wanna quickly go over some pros and cons. First the cons. Not every clip is polished. It's about 80 to 90% finished. So sometimes you have to export it, do a little bit of cleanup, and then export it again. I wish they had like a trimmer that you had on the web that you could just quickly trim the ends in the beginning. It would make things a lot easier. You also can't change where the captions are placed on the screen. Like sometimes they're high, sometimes they're low. They also don't implement a text safety margin. So sometimes the text is too high on the screen and it's not necessarily cut off, but it's hard to read. So I wish they had that added to it. You also can't tell it which clips you want it to select based on keywords. It'd be really cool if the AI had a prompt that you could use to tell it which keywords to look for and then create clips around that. But for what it is right now at this stage, it is amazing. It's worth the price. Like I can buy an additional three hours worth of editing for $15. That's well worth it. 
I'd pay $30, a dollar a day to have this software if I had to. So that's my quick review of this software. It's still very, very brand new. This is kind of a first look at its beginning stages. Just quickly wanted to make this video and show you a little bit about it. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos about AI and video editing or just video editing in general, leave it in the comment section below. If you want to see more videos just like this one, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching this video. I'll see you in a future video.